Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with an FGO video reaction and today I'll be reacting to uh, the Fate Grand Order Arcade uh, teasers which they gave. Like I reacted to I think two videos of Arcade before this and one of the videos I reacted to a few uh, Noble Phantasms but uh, turns out those were a handful of few of them as I can see like I, I found a playlist where there are like 90, 92 character teasers i never knew that i thought like all like you know the the, the few amount of uh, characters that i reacted to in the in, in the np video i have an np video on arcade in my channel i thought those were like the few ca characters that arcade had but there's like 1992 characters and i like you know i found out now today so i thought like let's check out all of the teasers these teasers are like one minute one minute 30 seconds teaser they kind of show when uh, the character is summoned in arcade and then the noble phantasm a little bit of the noble phantasm that's basically the, what the teasers are so obviously this will take a long time so i'm going to break it down into a few parts uh, of videos i'm not sure how many videos it will take for me to actually cover all the uh, teasers all the 92 teasers that are here in this playlist so let's see like i'll make let's see how much i can do in this uh, one video and i'll be breaking it down into part one part two part three like that so yeah and i'll be linking down the playlist uh, in the description box if you have not checked the teasers out and you want to check them out you can do so so yeah let's get started so uh, the 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 arrangement is, is a bit random i can see here but yeah no problem all right the first teaser excuse me is uh rider sima e teaser so let's see all right here we go okay I, i'm going to uh, check them out and if i have something to comment about i'll kind of pause it and comment after like you know one noble phantasm ends so yeah all right let's get started so here we go Okay, let me see. All right. <laughs> the gold rider car card and here she is. No subtitles, but obviously this is JP. <laughs> you can call me whatever you want. <laughs> Alright. Okay. I can kind of understand like you know, broken Japanese. I probably will be able to Okay, let's see. Okay. There's has a noble phantasm. <laughs> Oh my god, this is beautiful! Look at that scene! Oh! Alright. Oh my god, that scene! I, I always thought, like, you know, in Simai's Noble Phantasm, whenever I, like, you know, played the game, mobile game, I always thought that this would look so beautiful. And it really does, like, the, the scene with the moon and all of them standing and the moon's reflection. Damn, that was really great. Th that's a really amazing noble phantasm, I have to say. And uh, as I said, like you know, there's, th these are like JP version, uh, like you know, uh, teasers. So obviously there'll be no subtitles, no translation, nothing. Oh wait, are there subtitles? No, there are no. Okay, uh, there'll be no uh, subtitles, no uh, translation. But I, I, I can kind of understand Japanese, little bit broken. You know, so I will probably be able to make out what uh, the servant he or she is saying. I won't be able to guess each and every word that they are saying, but I'll be able to understand what they're saying. Like, you know, like that kind of thing. <laughs> so, yeah, that's basically it. All right. That was, um, oh, just a sec. That was Simai. And uh, all right, let's go to the next one. Okay. Next one is gray, I think. All right. Yes, gray. Oh my god, she looks so cute. <laughs> oh, 
ご迷惑をかけるかもしれませんがどうぞよろしくお願いします Why does she look like that? She looks like the... I don't know Alright, let's see The Noble Phantasm Alright Okay Wait, she wait a second. Didn't she she didn't say the, the, the thing that she says? Grey something like that? What what does she say? Grey no no. Rave or something like that. You know that there's like a, a thing that she says. She she did not say that here. I'm guessing it's a different uh, Noble Phantasm line. Oh yeah, she says rave, deprave, uh, so something like that. So yeah, anyways, uh, so that was her. And I love her character design. She looks really adorable. <laughs> oh my god, okay. All right, let's, let's check out the next one. The next one is Artoria Lancer. Okay. Artoria Pendragon Lancer. And the golden card. <laughs> oh my god, the horse. <laughs> I'm your servant, Lancer. Okay. Alright. She's wearing her mask. Okay, no, there she is. Oh! Whoa, she looks majestic, obviously. She's a king, so. <laughs> and. Alright. Okay, I'm going to. Alright, I'm going to uh, keep a note on which Noble Phantasm I love the most. For now, I loved Asimai's Noble Phantasm the most. You know, it looks so amazing. Alright, so that was R2 Ape and Dragon Lancer. And <laughs> I love the fact that her horse also has a little, <laughs> you know, voice line. Like, uh, the horse kind of, like, you know, doing that thing. <laughs> oh my god, that was good. And, uh, yeah, her, her Noble Phantasm is obviously very simple, so nothing much to say. You know, she basically jumps up and crashes down <laughs> onto the earth. <laughs> yeah, alright, the next one. Uh, oh, the next one is Paul Bunyan. This will be interesting. Let's see. <laughs> oh. She looks so small here, but you know how 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 huge she is. <laughs> She's saying that, why am I a girl? It's weird. <laughs> well, obviously. Okay. Alright. Oh! <laughs> oh! Wow, that was good. Okay, um... Yeah, this is a tough contender for Simai's position, but I still like like Simai's Noble Phantasm more than this. This this was uh, like you know, this is quite interesting Noble Phantasm, and uh, yeah, like <laughs> when she was in introduced, it, it seems as if she's so small, but no, she she's not actually. <laughs> All right, okay, let's check the next one. Uh, oh, the next one. Oh, this one I saw. This is uh, Jax de Molay. Uh, in the previous video, I kind of reacted to him. So obviously I know what how he is. But let's check it out anyways. Seiba, Jack do more. Koko ni makari koshimashita. Ah, watakushime wa more to oyobi kudasareba. Dozo, omishiri okio. I don't know why, but I feel like he's a little bit awkward, you know, like, like when he kind of says, ah, Watakshiva, like that. 
And suddenly he changes his way of speaking. Alright. I saw this in the previous video, so. Okay. Alright, so that was Jackson Mole and yeah. Excuse me. Uh and uh, yeah, uh obviously like I, I reacted to it him in the previous video, but uh, his his nose fantasy is pretty simple as we see, like he, he's in a graveyard, I think that's a graveyard, yeah. And uh, he just strikes the enemy. And uh, yeah, and, and I remember in the previous video, like you know, he had a little bit of uh, what do you call it, uh, you know, attraction towards sheep. You know, he was kind of talking about sheep or something. <laughs> That's one thing I remember. All right, uh, the next one, uh, Leonardo da Vinci, uh, the big one. <laughs> okay. There you go, the golden caster card. Oh boy. Okay, I guess. Oh, <laughs> oh more universal. I think that's that's the name of an old phantasm. Yeah. Yes. Whoa. All right. Um, I'm a bit biased towards Da Vinci because because of two reasons. Number one, obviously we have seen her for quite a long time. She's here here from the beginning. And another one is she is voiced by Maya Sakamoto, and I love her voice acting. So good. So, you know, like I'm a bit biased towards her character in itself. So, yeah, like I really like Da Vinci, obviously. And, uh, and like, currently we don't have the big Da Vinci, we have the small Da Vinci. But yeah, they're, they're the same, I guess. Anyways, all right, next, let's check out the next one uh, Ozamandias. Oh my god, I'm looking forward to his voice lines. <laughs> dajaku, dajaku. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Ah. King of Kings. Um Someone will not be happy with that set statement. <laughs> If you know who I mean. <laughs> oh, wait, he, he really says that. <laughs> uh, okay. You know what? I think this is uh, this is going to take see my place now. I loved his noble phantasm. The way he's kind of standing, uh, you know, behind everything, and the two pyramids come in, like you know, the his noble phantasm happens. Wow, that was good. Yeah, currently Ozamand is in the is in the top position. All right. Um, the most important thing here. Let's hear that one more time. Hmm. Ah, there you go. <laughs> Oh my god, I, I was just saying, you know, like obviously like I know that uh, like the whole Dajaku Dajaku thing But I, I never thought that he's he's going to say that in this episode uh, in this video, but you know <laughs> All right, okay the next one uh, Dantes mm. All right And there he is! Ah, okay. Oh my god! 
俺こそ黒き怨念エクストラクラスアベンジャーであるわお、he's very expressive オーケーウォー我が行くは温州の彼方オーライトレッシーダムアブセルシャトーティスオーオーケー this was cool オーライトオーケー one thing as I said like I could understand especially because this, this is the arcade version He is very expressive.、Uh, in the mobile version, obviously, you cannot see much of his expressions because they're just still images. But here you can actually see the expressions change and everything, and how, of a, like, you know, like how crazy he looks, his, his eyes and everything. <laughs> so, yeah, that's one thing I noticed. And yeah, that was good. All right, let's check out the next one. Oh, the next one is、uh, Sen uh, Setanta. I saw、uh, him in the previous video again when I reacted to it. So I know him. Yo, Master! Setanta! Ma, who who in the name of Arundaga? Kuran no Moken. Arusta, Zuich no Eu, the Dodo to Nanurnia. Hima no Rea, Madame, and Mijukuda. Yeah. You're still young. Okay, so. <laughs> His personality is really the same, like the, from the normal k u k u l i n Alright. Oh boy. Okay, um. Uh, one thing, as I was saying, like, you know, his personality is really the same. This personality and the Ku Hu Lin adult version's personality, which is pretty, like, you know, different from another person we know. If you guys can guess who I'm talking about, Gilgamesh. Like, you know, his kid version and his、uh, teenage version. We, obviously, I know the reason because、uh, in his kid version, obviously, he, he's a kid. And as he grows up, he becomes arrogant and, like, you know, more prideful. And then, like, you know, the whole Fate Stay Night happens, Fate Zero, Fate Stay Night. And after that, he gets more twisted because of the black mud from the Grail. And he, like, you know, does the things that he does in、uh, Fate Stay Night. So,、uh, but, but after that, obviously, like, you know, like after losing Enkidu,、uh, he becomes a really changed person, a very wise king. And the Gilgamesh caster we know is, like, you know, we can see him. And he's one of the best kings ever, Gilgamesh caster. So, there's a big reason for, behind it, but it, it, still, like, you know, it kind of like, you know, catches my, our eye that like, the differences of this Kuhuling and this other Kuhuling, basically, there's none. <laughs> but the Gilgamesh, you know, the kid Gilgamesh and the adult Gilgamesh are so different. Anyways, all right, let's see, let's check out the next one. Okay, the next one is Holmes. This would be interesting. <clears throat> All right. Okay, let's see. Jiko Shokai no Hitsio Kana. What a sham, Tante. A you no zon de tanara. Zan n to you, Hokanega. Tante a sweetico shomonara. Kini a yoi card or hikiateta. Whoa! Damn! Cunning stomach. Add a spectre to Holmes. <laughs> Elementary, my dear one. Wow. Wow. Elementary, my dear. Okay. Wow, this, this was also good.、Um, yeah, I think. Nah, the, still, I think I, I like Ozamandios' one a bit more than this. But yeah, this was good, obviously.、Um, I don't know like, what you guys feel, but I don't know why, but I feel like Holmes's、uh, voice is not what I expected it to be.、Uh, it, it must be, like, you know, it might be、uh, like, all me, but.
but the way he looks and the way he acts you know i i, I felt like his uh, voice would be a little bit more um i don't know goofy or something like you know the way he kind of jokes about and all but here is his voice sounds really serious like i i've noticed it in in the game as well like you know when we use her uh, use him as a character his voice so i don't know it must be only me because uh yeah like anyways that's a completely different thing all right let's check out the next one uh the next one is Eresh Kigal. oh my god okay this will be good <coughs> All right. Ah, there she is. Okay. Oh. Servant Lancer. Maker's own assassin Erish Kigal. Shogun Ni Oji Sanjou Shita wa? Oh my god. Ni Oji Ni Chikara o Kasu no wa Fuhoi da kedo. よばれた以上は助けてあげる。感謝なさい。ああ。いや。なんで黙ってるの。私立派な女神なんですけど。オールライト。オッケー、アイ。あ、アイヘブノダウトアバウトダット。ユーアーグレートゴッデス、アイノ
I thought Astolfo was a female. And when that episode comes where John <laughs> John Diart makes the mistake of, you know, kind of saying that Astolfo is a female and like, you know, like Sheik uh, says that no, that, that he's a male. I was like, what? <laughs> like, I, like, most probably Astolfo is the, the first trap that actually made me like, you know, fall for it, you know, and oh God. <laughs> he throws me off. All right. Anyways, let's check the next one. Suzuka goes in Santa. I checked this out in the previous uh, video, but yeah, let's check this out. Anyways, I am very, very sad that she is not in the mobile version. それじゃあマスター一緒に恋を届けに行こうやっぱ<笑><笑><笑><笑> And she's even a free servant. Like that's even more <clears throat> like amazing for the arcade people, obviously. Not for us, the mobile people. <laughs> but yeah, like I really love her <clears throat> character design, her like you know everything, like the way she she really is the whole like has the whole JK persona. And uh, <clears throat> The way she talks and everything so <clears throat> excuse me like yeah like it's a real shame that she's not in the mobile version and i don't uh usually see characters actually <clears throat> you know exclusive characters in the arcade version coming to the mobile version that much i think uh leonardo da vinci rider is the uh was she was she first introduced in the no i i'm not sure uh, like I'm, I'm trying to say is like uh, was Leonardo da Vinci writer uh, introduced in the arcade version first, and then he she came to the mobile version, or was it the reverse? It was the only uh, like you know servant uh, who is uh, written as exclusive arcade servants. I, I checked out the fandom page. You know, like Leonardo da Vinci writer is under the tag of uh, exclusive arcade servants, and I was quite confused. I was thinking like we already have Leonardo da Vinci writer in the mobile version so why is she like you know the like you know why is she given the tag of exclusive servant uh so i, I was confused so i'm not sure about that so uh, i've never seen uh, as i was saying i've never seen characters from arcade exclusive servants actually coming to the mobile version so we'll probably never get her you know suzuka goes in mm, uh, santa so yeah that's uh really sad Thing. but anyways okay let's take the next one out all right the next one mr heroine uh, xx <clears throat> okay <laughs> foreigner Whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, this is also quite pretty, you know, especially the uh, scene of the universe, you know, like in her, in her background and her coming and attacking. That's quite nice. And uh, yeah, also again, her noble phantasm is very simple, nothing much to talk about. So yeah, okay, let's check out the next one. Miyamoto Musashi Berserker. And I... I don't remember her NP that much. I think she kind of rides on a motorboat or something like that. But let's check the arcade version out. I don't even remember her 
you know, mobile version NP that much. But let's see. <clears throat> I'm always definitely going to roll for her in the upcoming event. Her and Carmilla Ryder, those two. <laughs> Whoa. What's she holding? <laughs> Alright. Okay, let's check out the Noble Phantasm. Should be good. Whoa! What was that? A watermelon? Okay. Whoa. Okay, this is the best. <laughs> this NP. Up to like up till now, this one's the best. I love the way, like you know, the wave kind of comes out and she slashes it into two and like you know comes back to the water and lands on the water again and goes on her very own way. So <laughs> that was great. Definitely I'm going to roll for her in the upcoming Las Vegas event. Her and Carmilla are my main targets. Um hopefully I get them both. So yeah, I hope so. Alright, let's check out the next one. The next one, uh, oh med med saber. <clears throat> oh I remember her noble phantasm. She she takes selfies, doesn't she? Or something like that. Let's see. I don't even use her, I have her, but I don't use her that much. <laughs> Wait, what the hell is that? I never noticed that before. There's a penguin. <laughs> I never noticed that little penguin on her hand before. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Who? Wow, this is perfect. It's Google in the enemy. God, <laughs> the cho the chose the enemy. Oh God! Well, I guess you know <laughs> it's kind of perfect for her. So yeah. Anyways, okay. As I was saying, like you know, I never noticed her little penguin on her hand before. I'm noticing it now. So yeah, that was good. Um, uh, her no phantom is really unique. You know the way she kind of poses and takes photographs it's really great and but i think i'll put uh nah miyamoto musashi is, is the top because i really love the effect that they used in miyamoto musashi's noble phantasm all right the next one uh artoria Rai, uh, alter rider <clears throat> okay this might be good you know the noble phantasm okay i'm looking forward to this one うん。サーバントライダー。アルトリアペンドラゴンだ。この私が来た以上、理想の生活を覚悟してもらおう。<笑><笑> <laughs> oh my god, okay, that was good. Alright. Okay, let's see. She's beating up Nero. Wow. <laughs> okay.
Oh wow, that was good. Oh my god. Okay, I think this this is the top now. Uh, I love every every each and every one of the noble phantasm. It's very really difficult. Okay, so one thing, <laughs> funny thing, like <laughs> the the enemies that they selected for like you know like for the for the videos for the teasers are perfect. Like. <laughs> Like if you remember in Carnival Phantasm, obviously it was not this saber, but the original saber, you know, the uh, Artillery and Dragon saber. Uh, like you know, they had the big like <laughs> you know quarrel between uh, what's the name Nero and uh, uh, Artillery and Dragon. They were like fighting and like uh, Artillery was calling her some like you know some kind of rip off, like you know red saber, all that stuff. <laughs> and Nero was getting mad. It's funny to see like uh, the enemy here is actually narrow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, I'm guessing they like deliberately did that, uh, and also like uh, for Ku Hulin as well, and Med and Ku Hulin. Like they selected the enemies very. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. Let's check the next one. Oh, the next one is um, a Hoxai uh, um, saber. I I think I've never seen her. Have I seen a movie Phantasm before? She is a free servant, isn't she? Damn. Alright. <laughs> 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 Guardian. What? How can you say that? <laughs> oh boy. We should talk. Okay, this is visually beautiful. Like Hokusai's uh, noble phantasms are all of them are really beautiful, especially visually. Like you know the whole uh, Hokusai wave that uh, we have in the background and all. Oh my God, that was great! And uh, she's a free servant, and we're going to get her in the Las Vegas event. I'm really looking forward to that because um, obviously I don't have Hokusai, and uh, uh, I never even tried for her before. I think I, I never had the enough enough quartz to try for her. I tried for Abigail Williams before, but I never got her. You know, so that's why I I only have uh, one single four star foreigner, which is Mister Sir and Alter, uh, Mister Sir and XX, and she's she's pretty damn good. I have to say, uh, she's strong. But yeah, like at least we're going to get a hoax site for free for people like me who do not have hoax site. So yeah, all right, that was hoax site. Alright, the next one. Oh, Ku Hulin uh, Berserker. Uh, if the enemy is med, I'll be really. <laughs> It'll be amazing. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> ah, there he is. Whoa. Damn. Wow, his character design is really great, I have to say. Oh, it's Nightingale. Okay. <laughs> it kind of makes... No, wait. No, that's Kaha. So why the hell did I say Nightingale? Oh, damn. Okay, just a sec. That was Kahat, wasn't it? Oh god, I... Let me see. No, he was fighting Nightingale and then... In the Noble Phantasm it changed to Kahat. Oh god. Just a sec. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, uh, yeah, what I was going to say is that... 
it really makes sense for it to be Nightingale because as far as I can remember, uh, Ku Hulin and Med had a big role in America, didn't they? Uh, you know, in uh, oh, and what, what was the which singularity was that? Five or four? I think it was five or something like that. So yeah, it really makes sense. Obviously, Scott also makes sense because he is the teacher. So yeah. Anyway, that was uh, yeah, that was good, but. Yeah, I really like I really like her his character design. You know, um, he's buff. <laughs> yeah, really. All right, let's check out the uh, next one, Sita. I I think I've seen this before in one of the other uh, videos I reacted to. <laughs> and there she is. Yeah, I, I've seen her Noble Phantasm before, and also... <laughs> yeah, I remember. She introduces herself as Rama's wife. <clears throat> okay. All right. Whoa. Okay, that was it. Uh, as I said, I, I reacted to this before, so I remember her lines and also her um, uh, noble phantasm. Because she's an arcade exclusive servant. So yeah, that was Sita. And um. I really like you know I really like her the way she kind of you know interacts with uh like I, I've seen her in my room lines as well it's really like you know like her lines and everything is really cute the way she kind of talks and everything and it's really adorable so yeah all right that was Sita okay uh it's almost 45 minutes I'll check out two or two, one two two or three more Noble Phantasm, and, and then I'll end this video. I'll continue it in the next video. All right, the next one, uh, Proto Merlin, and again I've seen this. This one is uh, uh, was from the, <coughs> no, it's from the previous video. What the hell is happening? Why is it buffering? Okay, there you go. Uh, okay. Oh God. Buffering. Anyways. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Just a sec. Did my uh? Yeah. Oh God. Ah, sorry about that. It kind of got displaced uh, because of the lag. Let's see that again. Oh no, this... Oh okay, it, it is like this, alright. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Um, yeah, the video's kind of messed up. <laughs> the, the characters in the background they're like oh my god <laughs> blessing from the heaven <laughs> okay yeah uh yeah i reacted to her and her all her my room lines and everything so yeah that was i already saw it but yeah she is another arcade exclusive servant all right the next one Nightingale and all right, this will probably be the final one that I'm going to react to in this video and I'll resume it from the next one. All right, let's see this She's my first SSR servant <laughs> Sweet and 
私は必ずそうします<laughs> oh boy. Whoa, what the? <laughs> wow. All right, that was it. Okay, I'm going to end this video here. Uh, let me check how many videos I did. Um, 22. This is the 22nd one. Whoa, this is going to take a lot of time for me to actually react to each and every one of them. Um, as I said, there are like 92 videos here. Okay, like so this will take like 20. That means it'll take like four more videos. Kind of. It's approximately. Four or three more videos so yeah it's kind of this will kind of become a series and uh yes okay that's it guys so that was this video this was my reaction to uh a few of the trailers uh teasers of the arcade version fate grand order the servants and uh as i said like and a lot of them i never really saw before i checked out a few of the handful number of uh arcade servants noble phantasm but that was just it a lot most of the uh, characters that i saw here uh, i did not uh, know how like you know the noble phantasm in the arcade version i never saw that before so yeah and uh, yeah that was great and for now uh, my top uh, pick is uh, artoria rider you know her noble phantasm that was really great like i i knew that was going to be great because it's the whole thing with the motorbike coming in and then the uh, you know the rifle the sniper rifle coming in and her actually getting on top of the bike and shooting <laughs> That was cool and another one. I have to say was really like, you know Amazing was um, Hokusai Hokusai sabers as I said like you know her the artistic uh, like, You know the the like, if you only judged it with the art sense she Hokusai saber would be the top one because it was great like you know the, the, the all the things in the background and all that was coming in and the you know the art that Hokusai did the I think it's called the Hokusai wave or something like that you know? uh, all that uh, like everything was there and like you know she was kind of uh, going within it and like fighting and um, that was just Saber's versions Hokusai I'm, I, I, the Saber, uh, Foreigner's version is also kind of similar you know where she actually uses the paintbrush to uh, <laughs> you know uh, uh, mind the enemies <laughs> and the waves kind of come up and i'm also looking forward to that i'm sure like you know we also have that within all of these videos i i hope so so yeah we'll probably see that in one of the videos in the future so yeah so yeah guys that was it so that was my reaction to these few uh teasers uh i'll be uh making part two of this video and uh within the, the next week either next week or before that you know like somewhere around that time like if i have enough time i'll i'll probably do it a little earlier than next week uh, otherwise i'll do it uh, on the next week you know the second part of this video and yeah that was great so thank you guys for watching this was my reaction to a few of the uh, teasers of arcade version and that was great uh, and a lot of them i i really loved i like the the, more, the main thing of these arcade versions are the animations the you know like all of those things the, the sound and everything uh, everything kind of makes it even more better so it, it it looks amazing it feels amazing and i wonder um sometimes i wonder like maybe like how will it look like if we actually get like, get some kind of uh eight grand order you know um game uh action rpg game or something just like you know a lot of uh, animes have games for example naruto attack on titan and a lot of the other games have uh, uh animes have their respected it games so i wonder you know how will it actually be and how will it actually feel to uh, have a game like that you know some kind of like some kind of rpg action rpg where you uh, i don't know like meet some servants uh, on your way uh, go on an adventure you know like craft stuff or something i'm not sure but you know something like that like it, it would it would be amazing so hopefully someday let's you know just 
<laughs> keep our hopes up so yeah guys that was it so thank you guys for watching if you guys enjoyed this video press the like button and subscribe if you win if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed consider do, doing so and comment down below your opinions on all of, all of these like you know uh noble phantasms and anything you want to say or anything you want to let me know i'll check them out and all the original links uh you know the link uh, for the playlist will be given down in the description box if you have not checked it out and if you want to you can click on it and you'll go to the playlist uh so yeah so yeah guys thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys uh in the next fgo video that i make obviously it will be part two of this video uh so we'll see you guys then and i'll continue uh the other teasers reacting to the other teasers so yeah guys see you guys then so until then goodbye and have a nice day